or a new project going on. I got this six by 10 trailer and I wanna, I wanna basically like refurbish it and just turn it into a, a better looking trailer than what it is, you know, to be able to, you know, move stuff, haul stuff and whatever I need to do with it, being that I don't have a truck bed. So truck bed. You know, it's bigger than a truck bed, so, you know, whatever. You know, I might get some toys or something. I don't know yet. But, yeah, I'm, you know, I want to turn it into a, you know, a good equipment or utility type trailer. But yeah, man, I picked this thing up for $300. But it comes with an extra spare. I already started sort of tearing into it. So they had it with little OSB covers. I think it was like a uh, like a pop up camper. So yeah, it looks like it's got like a, a 3,500 pound axle, and the the metal like it's pretty sturdy looking. So yeah, I think we could do something with this man. I kind of like how they did this. It's just like a it pulls out. And goes back in like a little door so i kind of like that so I'll, i might do something with that when i redo it but yeah this ain't this ain't what's happening right here so yeah man i'm gonna get on that and you know just get it all the way right so yeah man let's get started main thing I probably want to do is like yeah see how it is I just want to I'm gonna reuse you know most of the the outer boards and you know take them down so that it's you know shorter or whatever like so that there's no gap and then you know cut some off the top you know really and you know tighten, tighten this thing up man you know, we'll give it, give it a new deck, 
like uh, get all this OSB out and put like plywood or uh, like treated lumber, like deck boards, you know, something like that. Somebody was using that to haul stuff. Is that easy to get up? No, man. I'm not. I'm not trusting the OSB. No, man. So yeah, I'll check back in tomorrow. I kind of waited till it got a little too dark, but it's all good. We we getting some pro progress going here, man. We got it stripped down and we can see what's going on. And I'll be sure to take a, a better look at it in the morning. And you know, see how I plan on going about this. Man, this thing is worse than I thought. I just found this piece not on there. And just how thin it is, man. Like what what the I know it ain't uh it's whatever company built the trailer did that but that's ridiculous man i don't know what went there but man so uh i have to fire up the welder if i can't make this work but yeah man it's a lot going on here i gotta work work out so Yay, fun, fun, fun. basic idea of it uh, I have third thought I could I just want to do it three high um, no spacing so that way it's just a you know a good height to be able to put stuff in and you know all all what you need to haul Yeah, that's a nice height. I almost want to just go two. Yeah. All right, this is what we got so far. Uh, got the sides on. Still got to get the floor put in. But yeah, so far, so good. It's coming along pretty good. Yeah, I... Uh, Forgot to record putting the walls on, but it's it's a pretty easy design. Just stakes, and then just run boards along each of them. 
There's new ones in at the bottom and then the old two at the top. And then that'll probably get sliced off right there around each of them. So yeah, man. Uh, call it a day for the day and then get that floor put in tomorrow and get the door made. Yeah, I kind of been slacking on record. But I'm gonna record the whole rest of this, man.
got like a little curve going. Good thing about plywood, huh? You bend it a little bit, and it'll do what you need it to do. little stretch of it I'm getting these two corners filled in before I put the wheel caps on I'm gonna do a bit of a cheat method here slide these into the corners match this up and cut I do a lot of cheap methods, man. So don't judge me. turns out I could use the original wheel covers I just gotta put new wheels on top of them 14 and a half 14 and a half by 40 and a quarter
right, so this is the finished product. Oh man. Got the door on there. Got it all painted up. Got the deck in. Got the wheel covers back on. Oh man. Got all the little reflectors on it. Gotta, gotta have it safe. Install the wheel on the side. Eventually, I'm gonna get like one of the more, uh, what is it called? Like one of the more toolboxes to put on the front to put like tie downs and maybe a tarp in there or something. But for now, I ain't, I ain't doing that right just now. Yeah, man. Like man, you know, I put my hand into it and it broke. This. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. That's how we getting down, man. Got to make it nice and tight to where, you know, this thing got to be safe to be on the road, man. You know, well, that, that's all right. That's what happens to using the old, you know, wood. But, oh, man. But, you know, for, for what it is and you, know, you you can't beat that, man. You know, the thing's clean and nice and sturdy. You can't beat that. You know, all together I got, I think, $400 exactly. You know, $300 for the trailer. And then another, about another 100 in materials. So, I mean, you, you can't beat that for a, a, a 6x10 trailer. Usually 6x10 trailers end up being anywhere from you know, uh, 1500 up usually. And man, that's, no man, no. So yeah, man. That's what we're looking at here. That's what we're looking at. Big old, nice sturdy trailer to be able to, well not big old, but you know, kind of medium old trailer to be able to you know make it do what it need to do man you know yeah if i need to go get things i could do that i mean it's a pretty nice healthy size trailer i mean yeah if you look at it in comparison to like uh, uh well i don't know well that's my hand but i don't know how to put it into perspective it's a propane tank so i guess that'll work now you can fit a gazillion of them in there if you needed to but you know for whatever you're doing that's a good size man i call that a success man and let me know if you want you know other types of videos like you know, I, I like to build stuff sometimes and this was just something that I, you know, came across on Marketplace and I'm like, man, I can't pass that up. It's kind of breezy out here. Yeah, let me know if you like to see stuff like this, man, because I could do a whole lot of this, man. Just, you know, just recording other stuff that I like to do, you know, instead of just, you know, doing it, you know, I end up recording it and, you know, putting it on YouTube. So, yeah, just let me know.